we have we have this as well. Megan, I I I will spare you literally the subtitles and captions in this. Megan, you you can you can you can watch Megan's body language. I, oh, so so proud, so so courageous, so bold, so everything that she felt speaking, having the mic on her hand. Uh, it doesn't doesn't matter what she's saying because I can guarantee you. I have an app to, uh, you know, uh, develop the captions to generate the captions for these videos, as I showed you the captions in Harry's video. But these two, but mostly Megan, were speaking such a word salad, such amount of hogwash was getting out of those pie holes that the captioning app just couldn't make sense of it. When, when, it, when that happens, it sometimes happens because of the sound. But I tried to listen to what Megan was saying, and I realized that the captioning app was working well. But I, then I read what the captioning app was saying, and I couldn't make sense of it. I mean, what? I, I don't understand a word that she's saying. Now, I understand the words individually. My English is, is I'm at that level. I can understand English quite well, but I cannot make sense of what she's saying. And many on the internet are saying this, but the best part, the best part of Megan talking all this nonsense, all this drivel, is the moment that she was corrected by Harry. And for at some point of Megan spewing all this nonsense, she said something and Harry kind of interrupted her. I'm going to try to describe this before you see the body language. You're going to, you're going to see that their body language is, uh, well, quite a bit uh, unsettling. Because Megan realizes that, what, are, are you, are you like, contradicting me, and Harry tries to get away with it up until the last minute. And this is when this happened. She was, keep our families and children safe, and whatever, and then I think everything has been conducted about the 10-year point, which is after we are 17 years into this. And you, you see that Harry is also trying to look, look for some kind of help, oh, right? La laughing, oh, like looking around him. Yeah, I'm, I'm right. I'm right. I'm right. I'm, oh, yes, yes, it's made. Uh, well, and then exactly, but again, it's the pushback as well. It's they trying to make sense of the question. And he repeats the question to Megan. Like, okay, I'm trying to paraphrase what you were saying. And even the, um, the host, uh, Chris Daly, tried to help Harry repeating the question as well. And that's why you say, you see that Harry is, Hunting <laughs> as time as time goes by, I, I will try to put the 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 audio so we can listen to this. But let's see up to the end. But how can we understand when you are not being transparent? And then you see that Harry realizes that he's gonna sleep in the chicken coop for a month. I'm gonna try to put the um, the sound in this. Okay, here we go with the sound. To be able to keep our families and our children safe. I think everything has been conducted uh, about the 10 year point or just after. We are 17 years into this, I think. Um, so the big question is how come social media isn't being adapted? Right, where are seatbelts? Like, exactly. But again, it's the, the, the pushback is what happens when you're not being transparent. Right. Right. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God! You, you understand? You understand what I what I'm saying? You, you see their mouths moving, and you don't have an idea. You you don't have a real idea of what are they talking about. I mean, I've seen, I've seen nonsense, and I've tried to make sense of nonsense before. But this is, it's obvious that Harry was nervous because he didn't think that he can bring something to the table. And the moment he thinks he can bring something to the table, he acts like he said a smart thing, demeaning a farmer for not knowing how to use social media. Uh, uh, it's entitled, stupid, 
It's everything at the same time. I, I don't know how to describe this besides a complete train wreck. And that's when you see that Megan. That's when you see that Megan. Like, what? You have that face. And what are you saying? And then she covers her neck, the offensive gesture. And you see that, oh my, I don't. He's not doing this. I cannot believe. I cannot believe. He's doing it. He's doing it. Don't correct me, Harry. Don't correct me, Harry. Don't you dare do it, Harold. This one has a has H Harry or whatever you're named. Don't do this. And then she oh, per clutching. Oh my God, no! And Harry, oh, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> Harry's looking. Help me here, please. <laughs> oh no, my God. Um, and, and, but by the way, I think he has some kind of what is this? What happened here with his hair? Did, did he did he cut his own hair? I don't know. But he's trying to make this gesture. Trying to yes, yes. Thank you, uh, Mr. Daly. You are helping me. Trying to paraphrase the questions so my wife, my lovely wife, understands that. Well, the answer is what I'm saying and not her. I I mean this. This was painful to watch. You know, I, I feel, I have, I feel empathy for every, every living being, for every entity. And you can feel the secondhand embarrassment like pouring out of our bodies as we watch this. This is so painful to watch, but this is what Harry has done to himself. And in the, the words of J.E. May, Duchess Marmalade, Harry is not okay. He doesn't believe in what he's doing. He doesn't know how he got to be on stage presenting to families who are grieving or troubled. He was nervous because he knows he doesn't have the knowledge or skill to present some content to these families that would truly support mental health. Harry is broken, pushed to do things he doesn't want to do, and isn't qualified to do by a woman who now refers to him dismissively as this one. This is not to, to take any responsibilities from Harry. He brought this to himself, and this is what he got. And I have to, I have to make this point about uh, Megan Small. Megan Small posted this on Twitter that many people might not agree with her or might not be happy with her, but this is a fact nonetheless. This, these are just the facts. I know you guys don't want to hear this. As long as Harry and Meghan are listed on the royal family website as continuing to honor their duty to the king and monarch, you better believe King Charles III condones their behavior and greenlights them to be half in, half out royals. Well, that is Meghan's more opinion, by the way. Um, but she's got a point. As long as the website officially says that they continue to honor their duty to the king and monarch, then you can assume that this kind of circuses are, um, are still fall inside the royal family's activities because, well, they are still honoring whatever, um, well, whatever they are doing is not honoring. But the problem is that they are still listed in the, in the royal family's website like that. Meghan's bio was even updated to include prince and princess titles for her two children, who are in the line of succession. Every time we see Prince and William, Prince William and Princess Catherine out on an engagement, you better believe your sweet beep, the Montecito degenerates will be riding their coattails, clamoring for attention, and Meghan's PR goes into overdrive. That's why, and you tell me if it's not why we got this announcement from Discount Barbie Ken right after, 12 hours after. Uh, the Prince and Princess of Wales sent theirs. It cannot be a coincidence. A coincidence. It cannot be a coincidence. But you begin to think about it, and Meghan Small has a point. Yeah, it's um, a bit embarrassing for the royal family if they are still listed on that website, because that means whatever they are doing is like they are in the same camp as uh, Prince William, and the rest of the senior royals and the working royals. You might say, but remember that you, 
my royal rogue is most of you are ardent fans of the royal family. We are reading and, and, and breathing and everything, this news every day. And this is not the same for the rest of the people. So the rest of uh, people that are not that into this royal news, they see Harry and William and they assume working royals, non-working royals, oh, it's the same, especially if the website says so. So yes, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a conflict in that regard. But well, I would like to know what you think about this in the live chat of more than 4,000 royal rogues right now connected. And that is just amazing. I'm just, just flattered that you are here, my rogues, and so 